we pray together in the name of the God who creates life, in the name of the Saviour who loves life, in the name of the Spirit who is the fire of life. And let us be still now and be aware of God's presence with us now. And in the silence of our hearts, let us give thanks for the gift of this day. We pray for the people of our diocese and today we are praying for the united benefits of recover. So let us pray. Almighty God, we pray for the people and churches in the united benefits of recover and we pray for Sue and for Stephen as they lead that team and for Lindsay as well. We pray for their school, recover Church of England Junior School. We pray for the teachers, the governors, we pray for all the children and their families at this time. We pray for Sue and for Stephen and Lindsay as they make decisions over their mission that they have been planning over Pentecost. May you give them wisdom and guidance over what to do with all of their plans that, they've, that they have put in place. Lord, may they find creativity in the decisions they have to make. And may this time this mission be a great opportunity to share the good news of your love and your joy and your peace even though they cannot meet together may you bless this mission and all that they seek to do Lord, we pray for our brothers and sisters around the anglican communion and today we pray for those in nigeria and the south sudan we pray for Bishop Henry and we pray for Bishop Moses and we pray for Bishop Wilson. May you bless them and guide them as they seek to lead your people. May you give them all that they need to love you and to serve you. We pray in Jesus name. Amen. A blessing before we go. The blessings of heaven, the blessings of earth, the blessings of sea and of sky, on those we love this day, and on every human family, the gifts of heaven, the gifts of earth, the gifts of sea and of sky. Amen.